and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code PULA at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, we got our 1030 content. As of now, we definitely know we have the power-ups and the new solo challenges. I'll be going over all that. Hopefully, when I go watch the stream, we'll find out some more stuff, guys. I'm super excited. Hopefully, we get some more stuff because I think the Combine promo is coming Friday. So, it'll be nice if we can get a few little things to have fun with before the Combine promo does end up coming out, guys. But before all that, guys, I want to thank you guys so much. Give you guys a big shout-out. We hit 20,000 YouTube subscribers, guys. We are one-fifth of the way to one of our biggest goals in life, which will probably be the 100K milestone. Guys, that is crazy. We have one-fifth of the way. That's only in our first Madden. Like, our first Madden. Like it was expected. It was This wasn't expected, right? Now, if we could keep the same momentum and we can really just double this going to next year, we could easily be at 100K in like a year and a half, two, uh, two years. So, guys, that's just crazy to think about. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, but thank you guys so much. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you. To my 20K gang, guys, we went strong this year, boys. Let's close out Madden strong. Now, guys, I want to let you guys know I do have the giveaway winners announced for the first day or so. I believe it was the first day. So, let me announce those for you guys. I did take screenshots for you guys. I ruled them this morning. So you guys be ready. So on the coin making method in Madden 20, which was my first one, this is probably the banger one. I believe this is the one that got the most total. This is the, mo the most total likes. Uh, so that one's going to be the guy who wins probably the most coins for this one. That one had 1,156 likes. So this the winner for this one goes to Miguel Mandrigal. Mandrigal, sorry if I said your name wrong, Miguel. But Miguel, you comment the crazy I've grown. Xbox One name, not going to say it out loud. But DM me on Twitter. To claim your reward, and we'll get that done as soon as possible. And then for the second video, which I believe was going to be the market keeps crashing video, which only had 378 likes, but it's still a decent amount of coins, is going to be, let's see, Kyle Datner, like number 233. Love your vids. You're about to get 20K. Shout out to both you guys. Now, I will be announcing the giveaway winners for some, the day after that for some, in tomorrow's video, so stay tuned for that. Coin, don't worry, guys. The coins are fine. I just have a lot of stuff to sell. I've been sniping some cards. I'm gonna get those up. So hit me up on Twitter, guys. Both of you guys. That's proud of for that. Now let's go check out the stream. Let's get into this video, guys. And by the way, as far as the power ups go, we do have quite a few things that should be coming out, such as the power struggle solo challenges and the new so all the new power up cards, which Kyler Murray looking super solid. But you guys will see all that in game as they do come out. So stay tuned for that, guys. I'll be back, guys. So. Some of the news that we did get from today's thing beyond the power-ups was that there will be a lot of players coming in Friday. So a lot, Carillo said a lot of new players coming into the game, and he's referring to Friday's promo, which does lead me to believe that there's a chance we might be getting team MVPs instead of the combine promo, which is possible. I'm still making my video over how to prepare for the combine promo because that will be coming shortly after anyway. So I'm really not too concerned from that aspect because I do expect that we'll still be getting enough of something. Or we'll be getting it soon enough to where it doesn't really matter. But it's still kind of interesting that they haven't announced anything. They're later than usual. Team MVP should have came out like five days ago already at this point. I really don't know what they're doing. But let's head into the challenges and go check out the brand new solo challenges that were released today in Madden. So let's head all the way up to the power-up challenges. Play these challenges to earn new power-up players. Now milestones. You can earn up to 20... What is that? How many quarters is that? 2,000, 2,000... Oh, it's 6,000 coins. I thought it was like 10. I thought it was 10 tiers. I would say 20,000 coins would have been super solid. But 2,000 coins, you can get about 6,000 total. So, power struggle. Earn power up items for Marcus Peters, Raheem Mostert, Chris Godwin, Mark Andrews, Devin Bush, Kyler Murray, Arik Armstead, Sammy Watkins, Austin Eckler, and Jair Alexander. If you guys don't already know, Jair Alexander is my boy. He handed me some game worn equipment at the Packers game. So, me and him, we're brothers for life for now. So, 10 cards total. And guys, these are free cards. All you gotta do is play them. And I thought they would have been full games. They're all third quarter moments. So literally, you drop into this game and you start with the ball. If you drop into this game and start with the ball, it's game over. You just put it on a. All you literally all you have to do is just put it on shoe clock and shoot the game out. Take, these solos usually take you like three to four minutes per. So I'd imagine like forty minutes to an hour to get all of them done. Even if you're being slow about it. Now you do only need two stars, which pretty much just means you could play it on. Um, you have to play it on at least two stars, I guess, right, to get it. Yeah, you have to play. So play on normal. Really not going to be hard at all. It's barely harder than easy. So get that done. Now, which ones do I recommend getting? In my opinion, that you, I think you want to really get because they are free, obviously. I think the best one you want is Kyler Murray by far. Kyler Murray got a 96 overall LTD card, NFL Honors. You can easily get him. You could power him all the way. Use a power pass on him and have one of the best rushing quarterbacks in Madden right now. Probably the fastest quarterback in Madden. I recommend you get Raheem Mostert because he does have a 96 overall NAT card that a lot of you guys could have gotten from doing the um, the Super Bowl present set. 
So again, another card that could finally be really amazing with a power-up. He was kind of lacking behind before because he did not have a power-up card, which definitely hurt his uh, his prospects. Chris Godwin, another solid one you could be getting because obviously he has a Team of the Year card and another card that we're not that great without his, um, his power-up. Mark Andrews is kind of an older Blitz card. I don't really care for him. Devin Bush, another solid card. He's one of the best user linebackers right now in Madden. So give him a power-up solid. Now, guys, know before you ask... You cannot toss your Rick Premier into this Devin Bush. I got access 100 times yesterday. Nothing wrong with that. I understand the confusion. It sucks. It really does. I completely agree with you guys. You should be able to power up rookie premieres, and they should be able to just progressively upgrade with their power up. It's very stupid they don't allow us to do that. We pay for these cards. We should be able to use them as such. But they know that we'll pay for them in this Madden, and then next year we want the power up, so we just end up buying another one. Guys, don't fall for it. Arik Armstead is probably the next one I'd recommend doing because he does have an LTD. Uh, 96, which means you can power up, power pass him up. He'll be like a 97, 98 on your team very easily. And then the final one's going to be Sammy Watkins. Again, if you did any of the Chiefs or the 49ers Nat Super Bowl sets, you have a lot of these players Nat. And these cards can become pretty beastly if you did them and you power them up now. They can become pretty good cards in your team, easily be end game cards in your team, even as a wide receiver three or four for the rest of the year. Now, the ones I don't really care for are Marcus Peters, Mark Andrews, um, Austin Eckler. And Jay Alexander's decent, but he hasn't gotten a card in quite a while. Although he could probably get like a team MVP or something in the near future. So don't really count him out as far as a useful card. I just don't think at this exact moment in time, these are the best options. Now, I mean, these are all free. You can get every single one if you want. You can even go ahead and sell some of these. Let's go check out if any of them are up already. I imagine there's going to be some assholes right now putting them up for like 50k. So let's go check that out. Before we get it, we got a Twitch drop. So let's see if we want anything here. Hopefully, I'm so open for that day that I pull like an LTD card out of one of these Twitch drops. Although that day will probably never come. They probably have that coding turned off. So let's see if they're going for anything. Now, guys, as far as like as far as Friday goes, guys, we still have a chance of getting the team MVPs. It's kind of late though, so if they drop team MVPs Friday, I'd imagine they're still dropping combine around the 25th, which would be kind of weird if they do do it in that order. But you know, you can't really be uh, you can't hold the A out for anything. They do some really they've been later this year in general, so I would not be surprised by any stretch at all if they did go ahead and did that. Okay, so 10k. Okay, that's not bad, guys. So they're gonna, they're gonna be super cheap. If you if you're too lazy to go play the solos, you can just go buy them if you just want Kyler Murray real quick. Not gonna be a big issue. But I personally recommend you go ahead and you go play the solos. You can get them all done. You could probably sell them all for like 3K. So I could be like 30K there if you really just want the coins. And if you get them done super quick, you can get even more coins from that. It really always comes down to how quickly you play them, how quickly you get them done. Now, guys, beyond the power-ups, there's not really much else that's going to be coming out. I believe this is probably the last content we get until Friday, which so we're going to have a slow Wednesday, slow Thursday, because then on Friday we do have... We got the we got the new promo, so we, that's about the only news I got. Is that a lot of players are coming, and team MVPs typically drop about like 64 players. Although they were bracketed, it's still 64 players, kind of a lot. I'm gonna open up one, get a gold real quick, just to see if we can test our luck with that, since we do have about 5k working there. Although I probably should be saving these coins for these giveaways I'm doing, but let's pop about 5k real quick and see if we can pull anything out of this pack. We do get a harvest card. All right, 79 Riley Reef. Okay, nope, that's that's ass. So like I was saying, probably the last bit of content we'll be getting for the next few days. It's all good though, guys. Remember, I'm dropping two videos today, two more videos. I'm dropping the NFL What's Expect Combine video. Definitely go check that video out, guys. Banger video coming later today around 3.30, so stay tuned for that. Have your Noti Bell turned on for that banger video, guys. If you want to make a ton of coins, turn on your Noti Bell for that video. As well as, I will be doing a giveaway on that video for a ton of coins again, so make sure you pop out to the video and come into the giveaway. But guys, that's pretty much it. Just to reiterate the giveaway winners, in case you guys are wondering... We have Miguel Madrigo, Xbox One, and then we got Kyle Datner. Again, if you guys need, if you guys don't know how to enter or anything for today, later, later today's video, you just gotta like the video, comment the number of like you are, and subscribe to the channel. And beyond that, guys, for the two guys who won, DM me directly on Twitter, guys, for all you guys. If you follow me on Twitter, it's always the best place to follow me on. You can DM me directly there, and we could talk directly on there if you ever need any help. And guys, that is about it for the video. I hope you guys did enjoy. I hope you guys are, are ready for this content week. Now, guys, real quick, if you guys need any tips or tricks real quick to how to handle right before the team MVP promo, guys, that promo, it's just going to be a, it's going to, it's going to be a really big theme builder type promo. So like theme teams are going to get a massive update. So if it is going to be a theme diamond theme type stuff, it's going to be a lot of theme team type stuff. So last year there was a lot of great cards, but it was more than, it was more than not a theme team promo. So don't go crazy thinking that you gotta prepare for it or anything. I'll make a video on it, of course, but it's more of a theme team promo. So if like there's a Giants card, let's say 97 Saquon, there's there's gonna be like 15, 20 other Giants players. So they're all gonna be lower cards. They're gonna be decent. The MVP is about the only card that's gonna be worthwhile in a regular team, guys. But that is about it for the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy. Make sure to like, 
comment, and subscribe to the channel. Turn on that notification bell, boys. Come join the family. And make sure you give this video a big thumbs up. I'm out. See you in the next video. Peace.